The team members are starting by I, Nolo Tandu secondly, Matabo Mambani, thirdly, Ompile Matala, and lastly, Tiemo Sibusen. Our topic is the ICT in education. We chose ICT in education because it is one of the 10 pillars in Gauteng's Department of Education. Ompile Matala, what were the actions that you took during this project? The action we took as a team are the following. We had a school trip with the surplus of 38,200. The trip took place at Mavupin and the learners got a chance to learn about the history of South Africa. Isn't that great? We also had a fun day with the surplus of 56,350. We involved neighboring schools and parents also came. As a team, we were very happy to make such a big amount. In total, we made 94,550. Thank you. Thank you so much, Ompile. That is very impressive. Tiamo Sibusen, what changes have you made uh, during this project? What the 94,550, we were able to have a computer lab, which learners are really enjoying to use, and also there is no more absenteeism, and the pass rate has also increased. Um, thank you, Tiamo. That is great news to hear. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, Mata Mumpani, how did we overcome our challenges? The challenges that we face is that there's been absenteeism with some of the team members and we resolve that problem by sitting down and discussing the problem from their side of the story. And from, from the help of our loving and caring parents, we were able to resolve that matter and our project was a great success. Thank you, Matawo. And lastly, I would like to thank all of my cabinets for fulfilling their duties and for making my job way much easier. I thank your dedication and everything you have put through this project. Thank you. Thank you. During the perusal of YCAP Toolkit, I learned how to manage a team and that dedication is the key to success. I learned that planning is very important before organization. I have learned that everyone in a team should brainstorm ideas. I have learned that learners do not enjoy physical teaching anymore. 